Hey everybody, what's up? And welcome back to my channel. I am so blessed to be here today. It's been cold. Power's been going out all over the city. It's negative degrees in wind chill. Snow is still falling outside, but I am so grateful uh, that I'm here today with you all and that you are here today with me. All right, so today I'm going to show you an easy, simple, inexpensive, and natural way to freshen up your entire home. When I say that it freshens up your whole home, I'm not exaggerating. This will freshen up your whole home naturally. You don't have any of those random, uh, harmful uh, chemicals through the different sprays that you can get at the store. This is something that you can do simple in your kitchen. So check it out. All right, so today we're going to be making a simple air freshener uh, right on your stove. Super simple, super inexpensive, but I guarantee that it will have your whole house smelling so delicious. So before we get started, I want to let you guys know that we are restocked with our Whip by Danielle body butters as well as lip balms. So go out to whipbydanielle.com today to uh, order whatever you need to make sure that skin is moisturized and hydrated all day long. Whipbydanielle.com. All right, so what you'll need is a half of a lemon, already cut there for you. You need two cups of water, a little cheap spoon. Um, I just had some spoons from Sam's that I got, so I got this cheap spoon. A couple of cinnamon sticks, a saucepan, and whatever essential oils that you want. I want a citrusy type of a vibe going on in my house, so I have an orange, sweet orange, and a lemon essential oil. All right, so let's get started. So you have your two cups of water you want to add to your saucepan. Don't make a mess like I'm doing. I'm spilling out for whatever reason. All right, and then you want to add your lemon. I like to squeeze my lemon before I add the whole thing. Oh, and remember to take the stickers off of your lemon. That'd be important. <laughs> it doesn't matter about the seeds, right? You're not going to eat it or drink it. So throw that in there. You got your two sticks cinnamon sticks and then what we're gonna do is turn our eye on high at first so we're gonna let that come to a boil all right so as that's working we're gonna add our essential oils so just about 10 drops of lemon or so <laughs> and about the same amount of orange I'm putting in there. I'm not measuring anything. It's not going on anybody's body or you're not eating it or digesting it. So you can be as liberal as you want to with the oils. Oils are expensive so you just want to make sure that you don't go overboard. You want to gently mix this together. Mm, you can already smell it already. So smells so good. All right. Now we're going to let it boil. So give it about five minutes and we'll be back and show you all of the great steam that's going to create the aroma in your home. So as you can see, it's starting to bubble up on the sides. And once it comes to a full boil, I want you to see the magic of the steam because that steam will help mo uh, moisturize. <laughs> Thinking of body butter. That steam will help freshen up your whole house. I guarantee it. Okay, so y'all see all that steaming action right there? That's what you wanna see. That's what you wanna look for. That steaming action is where it's at. But please, please don't burn up anything. <laughs> Let it go slow and low. And that is what's gonna make the lasting effect in your home. Thanks so much for watching and be sure to check out the description for the full recipe.